basket. What's in the basket? Easter eggs? What's in the basket? What's in the basket? basket case wow anyway what do i do on this one you know this is a weird one to do something on this film because it's it's you know i wanted to look into it a tiny bit they shot basket case in new york they shot it for very little money you know and kind of like um you know but it, it goes to show you though that you don't need all too much to make something really 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 good right so if you make something really really good it's going to stand the test of time, right? It's going to stand the test of time. Simple as that. If you have a good story, right, and you have good visual effects, okay, and you have a good premise, and you execute it in the right way with the right tension, and you have a creature that's believable, right, the animatronics, you know, the money goes into that. You know, if you have something like Basket Case, and you don't waver on your vision, you know, then you're going to have something that, like I said, it's going to stand, it's going to stand the test of time. It's going to move people in the right way. You know, you're not going to get that with the horror films. So it's a very low budget film basket case, you know, but it never got the credit that it deserves. I mean, even just look at that advert there. You see how realistic the creature was? You see, you see kind of like the care and the attention that went into it, you know, and... Even that idea, kind of like, you know, what's in the basket? What's in the basket? What's in there? Picnic? You know? Apple pie? Whatever. It doesn't matter. I mean, like, it's just, what's in there? That suspense. You know, that kind of like, and it was different. It was new. It was different. You know, he was like a twin brother that was attached to him, and they got separated then later on in life. And they were kind of like twin brother brothers right so kind of like he carried him around in the basket but he was psychotic the brother was psychotic and even just right there great story arc you know he was jealous that he was going out and having his own life belial right so i mean what can i say about it what can i say about just watch it. Check it out yourself. I don't even know if it's available anywhere anymore. I don't know. There was, there was, you know, I think there was someone years ago who tried to get rid of the film to try and erase it off the planet so it, so it, uh, it didn't, uh, no one could ever see it again. You know, I don't know why they've done that because probably just jealousy, you know. My younger brother loves this film, you know, and you can see why, you know, you can see why it would, you know, it would align with his mentality, right? You know, he knows good films when he sees them. He knows them. He sees them. It's kind of like, yeah, that's 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 what I want to see, right? That's what I want to see, All right? So um, they made sequels from this film, number two, number three. I don't know if they made any more than that. Hopefully not. Because there's only so much of a good thing you can take, right? It's like, you know, it's too much. And it's just like, mm, mm, mm. it's enough now. It's enough. It was good the first two or three times. And, I, and now just, you know, leave it now. So it leaves a good taste in your mouth. You don't want to ruin it with more and more and more. So it was smart in that area as well. It didn't do what the other film has done. I'm like, oh, we'll just keep making them. No, it knew when to stop. You know, it knew when to stop. Someone suggested that, like, after the first frame was shot, stop then. Hmm. Too soon. No. What's in the basket? I yield. 